Well, as we continue our coverage on campus safety, we take a closer look at how students feel. Nine on your side's Tina Giuliano is live at the U of A now. Tina, what are students telling you? Yeah, Pat, here I spent uh, the whole day here at the U of A talking with students, many of whom are saying that campus safety is a priority for them. And I spoke with freshmen who have three more years to spend here on campus who say they hope to see a change. The college experience, after class clubs, dorm living, things that Kyla McDowell enjoys about college. Camp student radio, and then I'm also in a uh, K-pop dance group on campus. But there is something else top of mind for students, campus safety. I feel like it's nice to have these extracurriculars because it's kind of an escape from like not being safe 24 seven. I feel like I have grown up in the climate of school shootings in general. Before McDowell came to the U of A, she went to high school in Texas. So we had a big issue in regards to school safety um, with school shootings and bomb threats and things like that. As a freshman in college, McDowell is still seeing threats to campus safety, the Professor Meixner shooting and the possible threat to the law school. And I feel like in college it gets like slightly better because it's such a bigger group of people, but it still has a lot of issues. She has three years left on campus and after she hopes to go to law school. They should have been more professional about the responses, not trying to hide things from us. For those that live at home, like Isabel Vidaro, she says there should be more plans in place. What is like the best possible route for me to go if like something were to happen? The higher up should have a more like direct and clear statement as to what um, what is going on. McDowell says clear communication between students and staff is key. And we need to be able to like communicate together rather than it be two separate entities. At the U of A, Tina Giuliano, Kega 9 on your side.